Hey Scott, can you just remind us why we're all here again? It's Chloe's birthday! Yeah, thanks for that, Scott. Chloe will let you know if you show up uninvited to her party. Growing up, Chloe did struggle a bit to learn how to spell her name. We hope you don't get Chloe anything too fragile for her birthday. And she'll soon let you know if you bought her the wrong thing. A doozy! Hey, a doozy! That's the wrong sort, Mum. Oh, oh, no. But anyway, it's still good. It's still a doozy. Oh. Let's see. Oh, it's the one you talked about. Oh, it, it, at least it's a it's doozy. It's the wrong sort, though. But it doesn't matter, it's a doozy. So over the years, with all these presents that we haven't got right, we had to resort to the last option. What is it? Going up in the car. Hold it up, Chloe. Oh, you're a funny girl. <laughs> Please. We interrupt this segment to bring you breaking news. Good evening and welcome to Channel 86 News with Brooke Kettler and Chloe Williamson. Local news. There was a robber in Kings last night and he shot, and yes, I say shot, an elderly woman carelessly on the street of Kings last night. We cannot say his name because it's against the law, but she was shot in the nose. Back to you, Chloe. There has been a tidal wave in Wellington today. Two people were washed out to sea. There were 21 houses washed out and only left wood. 101 people died from the hideous wave. Jack Johnson saved three lives from the wave. Now, she might argue otherwise, but this is about as good as Chloe's musical talents have ever got. (laughs) She gave dancing a go, but that didn't have great results either. She was always enthusiastic though. (laughs) Dancing in bars started early for Chloe. Hey Greg, just a note, you may want to avoid Wet and Wild if you take Chloe on holiday. What happened? I can't go on any of the slides. Why? Did you get to two? Oh. Oh. Are you? Well, you want to tell you what to do. You're going to jump in here. Would you like to come back when you're a bigger girl? Hey, Greg, mate, look what you're stuck with. <laughs> Chloe really didn't handle life setbacks very well. Um, Chloe, look, just look in the video because it's mum's video, so really cry really hard. Let's hear it. A really hard one. And she never was going to be an Olympic diver. And now for the weather from your prime time Channel 86 team. Hi, and we're back with Channel 86 News. Our weather report in Auckland it has been it will be 23 degrees tomorrow. 
In Christchurch, minus 1 degrees. In Queenstown, 22 degrees. In Rotorua, 22 degrees also. And in Nelson, you have masters better have your boats tied up because it looks like the way from Wellington is heading towards Nelson Harbour. Preferably picked in. So people like the Mackenzies better have their boats away and locked up their houses. I hope people in Christchurch have their woolly socks on tonight when they go to bed because it will be freezing. Also in other news, Richie Mukula died from sand fly bites <laughs> in Spring Station. <laughs> Crusaders are playing the Stormers 51-36. We didn't score any try tries in the first half, but that's alright. Next week <coughs> is the last game. <laughs> okay. For the Crusaders, so good luck to you. They, the, the, the word around the town is that you're very, very good at netball. Is yes. that true? Yes. It is true. And do you think you'll go further with netball? Yes. Silver ferns? Yes. Lovely. Well, look, that's all, and I would just like to say now, out of the way, I'll be on the camera, thank you. Um, <laughs> what a wonderful, wonderful year we've had with, oh, uh, <laughs> with sport. <laughs> And look, that's it. <laughs> Signing out, Williamson's now.